When crooks plan a robbery, they think they have everything all figured out. Move in fast and ruthless. Resist and you die. No right where the money is sitting. Dump the guns and masks outside. And they're gone in 30 seconds. Los Angeles, California. The men in this stolen car have just robbed a Kmart. They think they have a plan. But a news helicopter has just spotted their stolen getaway car. They're going well over 100 miles an hour, really flying through this traffic. By the time the police receive a description of the car and get on the freeway, they have some serious catching up to do. Okay, dispatch, we're in pursuit. We're in pursuit, be advised. We're in pursuit. Do you copy? I copy unit is in pursuit. These guys are suspected of having pulled off a very efficient armed robbery of a Kmart store in Bakersfield. Officers push their cruisers to the limit, only to find themselves slowed down by rush hour traffic. Suspects are now coming up to a very busy Wilshire Boulevard, still going very fast. The crooks even planned a backup escape. The police are still coming, but they are still way behind. Their plan is to get to Wilshire Boulevard, ditch the stolen car, and lose the cops on foot. Wait a minute. But in all that planning, they forgot one thing. It looks like they're slowing down. They forgot that when you steal a car, you have to steal a car with enough gas to get away. It looks like they're out of gas. Can you believe it? This car is actually rolling to a stop. The cruisers rapidly form a perimeter around the car. These cops don't take any chances with potentially armed felons. Driver, get out of the car. Police are now, they're conducting what they call a felony car stop. They're taking these guys out one at a time. The cops aren't in a hurry now. They have their bad guys, and now they have their evidence. Money, all from Kmart. Each suspect caught red-handed with hundreds of dollars stuffed into his pockets, ready to bail and run for it. So what does all that criminal planning, a violent robbery, fast driving, and a so-called great escape route get you? 15 years in prison.